Hello, this is Team 5 Foxfish for ECE 477 Senior Design. We're going to go ahead and demonstrate our five PSSCs in this video for our project. Um, so our first PSSC is an ability to regulate from 5 volts DC to 3.3 volts using a DC switching regulator. Um, so we'll go ahead and apply power to the board and you'll see these LEDs are turning on which are indicating the different regions of the board have received power. You'll also see later in the video some of the functionality that really could only be achieved if we were providing 3.3 volts to our microcontroller. You can see up here in the top left corner of the board, that is our buck converter, which is stepping the voltage from 5 volts of the input down to 3.3 volts. So I'll get a little closer here so you can get a better look. There's a small chip there that's doing most of the work, lots of capacitors and small components supporting it. So next, our PSSC is an ability for a microcontroller to send and receive data from a Wi-Fi module using USART. So you'll see we have a controller module here mm -hmm. that is communicating via Wi-Fi to this module. And uh, this specific module on the board here that um, my lovely assistant just pointed out. Um, so now we can go ahead and power cycle the board just to demonstrate here. Uh, it'll go red here, which indicates that we're not connected. And once communication is established, we'll see that we get a green screen. So this is um, communication over Wi-Fi. Um, we can further um, go ahead and use our app and configure specific patterns on this display. So we're picking colors and then you know, various LEDs to turn on to that color. And then when we send that, um, we're gonna be able to see this on our display. Um, so there it is, the pattern matches. Um, so that's going to cover as well the ability to send data from a microcontroller to a grid of LEDs using PWM. That's our third PSSC, and uh, that can only be achieved uh, via the STM32, driving that PWM communication and being able to specifically target these LEDs to turn on. Uh, and then also an ability to configure specific LED patterns using a web app, our fourth PSSC. That's what this app is doing. And finally, our fifth PSSC is an ability to send data to multiple displays simultaneously. So if we go ahead and change what we're displaying um, up a little bit on both displays, get some green going, um, our second display should now be able to update at the same time as the first so that we see new data on both screens matching the patterns we inputted. All right, have a great day.